Today show co-host Carl Stefanovic has slammed James Sutherland with a stinging rebuke of the Cricket Australia chief executive this morning. After Sutherland refused to answer questions from Nine News reporter Michael Best about whether the ball tampering scandal was cheating, Stefanovic pulled no punches in his assessment of the Australian cricket boss. At a press conference in Johannesburg this morning Sutherland revealed Steve Smith, David Warner and Cameron Bancroft have been kicked out of the Australian cricket team and would cop severe sanctions when they return home. James Sutherland fronted a press conference in Johannesburg this morning over the ball tampering saga. Op watch the moment nine reporter stumps Sutherland below James Sutherland's response was pathetic. He was questioned directly about cheating, and refused to answer, Stefanovic said. Question over and over and refused to answer. Why? Why dodge it? It's cheating, plain and simple. Planned, premeditated cheating. You know it, I know it, the ICC knows it, James Sutherland knows it. Today show co-host Carl Stefanovic has slammed the Cricket Australia boss this morning. None news, no actual punishments were handed down this morning, at a time when the game needs strong and decisive leadership. And there are seemingly no ramifications for the coach. Whether you know about it or not, in leadership, there's responsibility. Mistakes have been made. Admit them. Own them. Deal with them. Accept the consequences, and move on. There needs to be a clear message sent to every player, every fan, every young kid in this country who loves sport, that this behavior will not be tolerated. And that message just wasn't there this morning. Cameron Bancroft, David Warner and Steve Smith are heading home from South Africa. Supplied, James Sutherland's response was, at best, weak. At worst, negligent. He must act, or go. Foreign Minister Julie Bishop also weighed in, saying the decision to send home Smith, Warner and Bancroft was the right thing to do. They had to return to Australia and not participate in the rest of the test. There is an ongoing investigation and we wait to see what Cricket Australia has in store for them, Ms Bishop said. But of course it was cheating. Any act to gain an unfair advantage acting illegally in sport is cheating. Michael Best Clean Bowls Cricket Australia Chief James Sutherland is not a fan of the C-word. During his press conference this morning, Sutherland was repeatedly pressed on whether Smith, Warner and Bancroft cheated in the third test. Nine times the word cheat, cheating or cheated came up in the bevy of questions fired at Sutherland it kicked off when Nine News reporter Michael Best asked Sutherland if he considers the ball tampering incident to be cheating. David Warner cut a lonely and silent figure at the team's hotel yesterday. Nine News Sutherland Angry, disappointed, unhappy and exhausted after crossing the Indian Ocean to deal with the most momentous scandal he has had to mop up, wouldn't bite. This is not in the laws of the game. It's not in the spirit of the game, and again I'm angry and disappointed, Sutherland replied, when the topic was first raised. Best was undeterred, sending down a near-identical delivery. Sutherland shouldered arms, again. It's not a good day for Australian cricket, he replied. It was a topic that several reporters, from Australia, England and South Africa, all revisited. CA's head of communications Tim Whitaker eventually asked journalists to move on, noting Sutherland had answered the question. Cameron Bancroft was found to have used the electrical tape to rough up the ball during play in the third test. A porter was finally restored and the press conference continued, but not before a brief clamor. There are two schools of thought about why Sutherland refused to use the word cheat. Fiercely, is the damage to one's reputation that comes from having such a frank admission beamed into the living rooms of millions of Australians. Qantas chief executive Alan Joyce has already called on CA to make a statement to the rest of the world, while other CA sponsors are also taking plenty of interest in the scandal. TV networks, currently negotiating a new rights deal, are also keen to find out what CA is doing to improve the image of its team. And secondly, the other possibility Sutherland held his tongue is because of CA's disciplinary system that governs how players are punished not wanting to prejudice any potential hearings. CA will only conduct a formal hearing if Smith, Warner or Bancroft appeal and are unwilling to accept their charge. Copyright 9 Digital Proprietary Limited 2018